Five, four. Move out of the way just a little bit. No, dude, go on, go on through, dude. It's cool. It's cool. Yeah. All right, just stay right there. Can we, can we see? Some, can we see the people? Okay. Five, four, three, two. Hey, this is Robert Mosley back on Underground Connection. We're out here at the Fair Park Coliseum with Pantera and Typo Negative. We're gonna be talking to Typo Negative a little bit later on the show. Right now, let's check out their video, Black Number One. All right, we'll do, we'll do another one with Christian Woman. <clears throat> no, no, keep on. Yeah, try that. All right, you ready? Yeah. Steady it with the other hand. St steady and focus it with this hand. That one goes on the lens, okay. Five, four, three, two, one. Hey, this is Robert Mosley, Underground Connection. We're out here at the Fair Park Coliseum with Pantera and Typo Negative. But first, let's check out one of their videos. This is Typo Negative with Christian Woman. Okay, let's stick with that. Turn it off. Did you ever, did you ever fucking imagine this video that joke? Let's move this fucking chair out of my way. I'll start with the introductions. Uh, you know, you can just introduce yourselves that way. All right, welcome back to Underground Connection. We're here with some of the members of Typo Negative. What's up? What's happening, brother? And you are? Johnny. Josh. There you have it, from the mouths of babes. Okay, so uh, I've watched you guys grow tremendously in a short period of time from, you know, club, club acts. Of course, it varies from city to city, but you guys have really gotten big, you know. Uh, what's your secret? <laughs> 14 months of touring straight. 14 much. months straight, man. Hard work. Well, what do you say is your best city so far? Is it New York? Or? Dallas is a very strong city. New York, of course, because that's where we're from. Yeah. That's going to be the biggest city. You know? We've had five years to work on New York as opposed to the rest of the country. That's cool. Hey, there's some guy. There goes fucking Rex. Well, so you guys are, are you, are you guys going to be sticking with Pantera through the whole thing or? Uh... Yeah. Yeah, we're going out there till, uh, we're going to be with them until April. That's cool. Uh, any, uh, any other like, like multi-band uh, operations coming up or anything spectacular, movies or anything? <laughs> There's no movies. We have a. We actually do have a, a song coming out on a soundtrack for a movie. Oh really? What? Uh, which one is that? The name of the movie is called The Addiction. Ah, cool. We're gonna have to get that. Remember The Addiction. Um, it has Christopher Walken in it and uh, Isabella Rossellini. Really? What? What song is it gonna be? Uh, it's a new song that that we wrote over the break. Uh, one of the breaks that we had. It's called uh, Haunted. Oh, that's cool. So you guys are actually pretty serious because you know. Uh, when we first saw you guys play and you did Summer Breeze, I mean, we just fell in the aisles. We thought it was great. So we would. So any more plans of uh, of new versions? Maybe Tom Jones or something cool like that. Maybe a uh, Partridge Family song coming up. I think I love you. Oh, hey, that's good. Uh. <laughs> Thank you, Ty. Yeah, this is. Uh, I'm one of the Discount Chippendales dancers. So. Our show is kind of a casual show. We try to get most of the local acts. And since you guys were local, uh, or, or what we consider local, whatever is a club act, you know, we try to stick with the people. Boy, look at this. This is great. You know, a lot when of Pantera I, when, fans. Well, yeah, they, they are. Believe it or not, there's a lot of them here that are out here to see you guys. Uh, because uh, when you guys first played uh, Mongos, I go, man, you these... This is spectacular. Well, you know, why are they playing the small club? It, the, there's a lot of bands that I've seen that just seem to be instant hits to me. And, and you guys, it seemed to be instant. Well, maybe We're not definitely instant. not one of them. Not instant. I'm sure it took you a long way, but when I, you know, first when I first saw you guys, hey, these guys are gonna make it big. You know, I said the same thing like about Pantera. By the time I figured out who they were, but of course, there's a lot of bands you say that and then they break up and never become a, also become think, anything. You know, a lot of the reason people think they're instant hits is because they don't see all the right. work that goes in before, which the media does not focus on. And once something is successful, yeah. it appears to be an instant hit, even though years of work went into it. That's what this show is all about. We try and pick out all the people we think should be instant hits that aren't getting the exposure they should be and help them bring it up to you guys' level. I mean, this is spectacular. 
Uh, well, this you know, really, this is in our level with a support act tonight. Yeah, yeah. Well, better than Mongo. Sorry, Mongo. We love you, but <laughs> 200 people, and this is like 20,000. <laughs> I'm not sure how many people's going to be here tonight. We're, we're not at a. We haven't like really reached like a, a higher like you know level when we we have nights off. We're still playing clubs like Mongos yeah. and stuff you like that. You guys underestimate yourself, man. You guys rule. You should be come up here saying, man, we, we rule. And you know, yeah, it's just, that's the reality of it. Yeah, it's, yeah. You know. You do. I mean, I think you guys are doing great, man. I mean, every time I turn on the radio station, there you are, and we call up and request you. And, well, we, we love it, man. It's I, a lot more I'm, wait, I'm waiting for some new stuff. Auto mechanic. Yeah, yeah. It's like, you know, uh, don't, don't feel pregnant. Half the time I'm working at Chevron, so. But anyway, you guys are fun, man, and uh, I wish you guys all the success. Next time, I uh, hope to see somebody opening for you when you're out here. Thank you. Thank and you. wish it be soon. I, you know. We'll see. Well, you know it, man. Hell, I want to see some you new shit. You don't know it. Oh, I know it, man. You guys, it's you cool guys will be real. gone tomorrow. No, nah, well, no, no, no. You guys are too cool, man, because, you know, if I didn't think so, I wouldn't have went through all the trouble just to interview you guys personally. I, you know, mean a lot to me. We hope you're right, brother. Yeah. Hey, man, I, don't underestimate yourself. Yeah, you guys rule, man. Don't, Thanks a lot. Don't think so. What, what do you got to say, Buck? The idea was to do uh, uh, the, the weird one. What was that one? I forget now. Summer Breeze? Yeah, Summer Breeze. Whose idea was that? That was Peter's. It's a favorite song of Peter's when he was younger as a kid. Well, yeah, just like me. I mean, I listen to some of the most hardcore stuff. And, you know, one minute I'll be listening to, to Big Band or Tom Jones or B.J. Thomas. Next day it's Megadeth. So. Fight! Fight! Yeah. Well, we're gonna get hit with a lot of stuff tonight. <laughs> Have you guys ever gotten chunked with anything real hard? Ever gotten hurt? Bricks, nothing bad. I'm behind the drums. It's easy for me to hide. Yeah, <laughs> just use the symbols. I, I've got some. I've got some uh, skins you gave me from the last show. I got yeah. some pictures I was gonna show you cool. and stuff like that. But, but, but seriously, you guys should believe in yourself a little bit because. You know, you're great. Man. Just keep working hard. <laughs> Just keep working, man. I mean, I know this wasn't like instant thing. Somebody came up and said, "Oh, hey, you know, here's here's the money and the records, and just go out there." I know you had to work for it, it's but no just money. keep. Don't give up. Don't give up, man. Just don't give up. Whenever you start feeling down, man, just 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 think about it. You know, a lot of people. Just take some drugs. You know, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I know some bad. There's some bands waiting down there for me down there who have been playing for like 10, 15 years, still haven't gotten shit out of it. You know, there's so. a lot of years put in, like you know, with our band. Also, I mean, not just yeah. since Typo Negative's been together. You know, how Some many bands have, have you guys been, been in? in? Countless. Countless. Tons. Uh, I bet. Well, I bet New York's pretty happening. I mean, they probably got a, quite a few clubs. That... They have a lot of clubs, but I wouldn't say they have any kind of uh, <laughs> scene, so to speak. Yeah, I've never been there. You know, you should uh, go by one time. Buy yourself a nice big gun. You know, just go out and have <laughs> yeah. a blast. You have a gun, right? You live in Texas. Yeah, yeah. A couple of 12 gauges and whatnot, yeah. Feel well protected. Take in a Broadway show, shoot a couple muggers, yeah. Boy, this is great. Well, I wish you guys the best of success. Thanks a lot. And I, I, I mean, I sincerely sure. mean that. I want to hear some new albums. I want to see some new videos. I want to see you guys out here with mobs of people screaming typo. You know, this is what I want for you guys. Well, as, as long as, as people want to hear something. Mean it. Because, uh, most of the music nowadays has just been so dull and boring, and there's nothing like fucking the typo negative. This is cable, we can do what we want. So. But you know, I mean, it's great, it's original. There goes the mosh pit, check that out. <laughs> oh, yeah, they're excited. You guys got to realize also, this is Pantera's hometown. I mean, I used to hang out with them when they were clubbing, and they clubbed forever. Yeah, we're, we're kind of uh, concerned about how they're going to feel uh, sitting through Typo this evening. No, they, you, you're cool, man. Believe it. You'll, you'll have a good following. There's going to be some. You know, some of your stuff isn't as heavy as Pantera, but <laughs> it's, a, it's a kind of different genre of music. Not to say it's not as cool, but, you know. Well, 
we'll, we'll see what happens. You guys got to get on stage. I want to see you yeah, up there playing. I can't wait for the time. show. So you guys got to go. I'll catch you guys later. Thanks a lot, man. But like I said, man, I, I really do sincerely mean that. Good to see and you And I want to see you guys do more. And I'll catch you next time you guys come through. And I want you to tell us about how great everything's going. I don't want to hear anything less. I hope, <laughs> I, hope, I hope there is a next time. All right, man. Yeah, I got one quick suggestion. Uh, there's a group called Cream. Israeli Gears. There's a song on there. Album. Yeah, great album. A song on there called Tales of Brave You Listen. Y'all should try that. Great you song. Know, no, I got that one. They gotta go. I know. Thank you. Thank you, bro. All right. Hey, here we go. Here's the man who actually does the working. Hey, how's it going? Peace. Uh, how was that show? Was it awesome or what? Dude, it could be more awesome. I just don't know how. I'm rubbing it in because he didn't get to see it. <laughs> What an asshole I am. This what guy a, saw it, though. What an asshole Pierce. I am. This is Pierce. Hi, how you doing? I wonder why they call you Pierce. Would it be all them things, uh, going, those little metal show rods him. going through? Show them, man. Show them. Oh, uh, show them. You can't show the other one. Okay. Let's see. <laughs> <laughs> I know some the chicks that's got that. The camera, not him. Oh. Here comes the man, GC. Yeah, there's GC, man. Oh, look, we're going to have to get him. Hey, hey here we go. Here goes, here goes, here goes TC. Here goes. Hey, 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 hey. You gotta see the cameraman whoop some ass. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. What is, what is, what is, what is, what is TC stand for? How do you like my friends? Totally fucking This is it. I like so, to save Did you get to see the show or did they make you stay house. outside? I had to stay out in the cold, but I caught a lot of it. Oh, sucker! Yeah. Sucker! We saw it! We saw it! Rubbing it in. Hey, what, what are we on here? Uh, this is Underground Connection. Underground Connection. So is this cable or what? Uh, well, well, we'll only use this if your station decides to sponsor us. How's that? Oh, okay. But right now we're just fucking around. <laughs> so what does TC stand for? Is it like tickled cunnilingus or what? No, is it's that? actually tremendous cunnilingus, but that's another story entirely. Dude, is this fucking hostile tonight or what? Fucking hell! Hey, hey, hey! Yeah! Oh, oh he's gone. Here. Right here. Hold yeah, this, man. Hey, back up a little bit. That's right. Does, any, does anybody have any idea what's the call station going right now? Fuck, I don't Fuck know. Fuck <laughs> What's the question? Yay, KVIL. OJ for president. Back up. OJ for president. Hey, let's get a fuck up for anal oral contact. <laughs> <laughs> anal Avenue, baby. Pictures, <laughs> badass. That's what I can say. It's too bad to say. Something like that. Okay, that's good. <laughs> All right. Guys that do the real work right here. Bet it's a pain in the ass, but we love it. We get paid for it. They, they, get, they, get, of, they get paid in, like, beer. Smoke a lot of free dope. You know. My kind of job. Where do I that's sign great. up? So, so what's with you standing around? Get to work. <laughs> I've been, uh, show some of the aftermath of this shit, man, look at that. I've been in this crowd, getting squished like a motherfucker, and I just pulled, what, 12 hours putting this thing together, helping put this shit together, and I'm fixing to pull another Are you getting paid? Five bro? more, turn it out. Oh, yeah. You getting laid? I hope. <laughs> getting be getting nice. stoned? Well, if you got all the three uh, major areas covered, then everything's all right. All right, that's cool. We got it. Check them out, man. Look, they just completely tear this thing down. And look at those people up there. You know, hey. Hey. Down here. Hey. I've only got one thing to say. Uh, silent but deadly. Okay. Half this video is me saying, okay, you can turn it off now. The real true cute little Pantera fan. He loves them. I mean, what, what can we say? His name is Sam Sam. He Sam looks scared Bang. to death. Is <laughs> no, Sam is not scared. He yeah, 10,000 screaming people did I mean, not bother him. And he still survived. He it. 
Imagine that. Uh, that's a dog. Watch out. Hey. They've seen Bonnie alone. Yeah, only, only the dog can do that. Tell him bye, Sam. Sam said the concert bye, was wonderful. Bye. Thank you very much. Bye. Is it? Bye, everybody. Isn't that cute? Bye-bye. And of course, I'm this evening. I'm very honored and blessed to be here tonight. And let me tell you one thing. If you ever had a chance to see George Foreman fight Ron Lyle, you are very blessed. If you haven't, you're missing out. Thank you very much. Words from a few of, uh, of Mad Max hung like a hammer. What'd you get? What'd you get, man? I don't know, man. I got these signed for a friend of mine. And he did oh, well, let, let's see. Show, show, it to, show it to the show here. We got uh, signed Pantera stuff and the drum skin. I got some old sign sticks from like Joe's, but so so. What was you saying about our president? Bill Clinton was in there smoking a big ass joint, man. He was fucking moshing. He fucked me up, man. He hit me in the head, knocked me down. He was going crazy, man. We just did he inhale this time? He inhaled. We saw. Yeah, him. We have shotgun to my face, man. He shotgun to me. Did he? Yeah, he shotgun to me. Because I, I, I heard he sucked a dick but didn't swallow, and I. I, just I don't know about that. He was offering it, but I couldn't. I just couldn't accept. I'm sorry. I'm not that tired. There you go, Clinton, the mosh king. <laughs> and what was Hillary doing? Was was she getting? I didn't see her. She kept going up on top, saying, "Feel me, feel me." Yeah, I heard she was topless, though. I heard it. Just I heard you could see her a mile away with those teeth and her tits. Those tits are perky. I heard. Yeah, I, I bet. Uh, somebody told me that her and some other chick was doing something in the back, or. They, you know, they, were, they, they were they were listening to right they were listening to Guar and had Vienna pickles up their ass or something I don't know what fuck yeah dude they know how to party man it's the cleans I still got the roach they had all right they're great so we got a little presidential hey, rockin'. That's what we're doing, dude. check it out we got a formerly known as disciple Daniel Lehman here happening get, we get old Christian too what do you got to say after all these years Dan of what what do you got to say after all these years? Rock and roll is cool. Straight from the mouths of babes. Uh, yeah. <laughs> what are you asking these guys? And they say that heavy metal makes stupid people. What? What does it say? Oh, nothing. Just in it, you can mumble anything incoherently as you like. Oh no, I would never mumble. I'm much too well of a speaker to just mumble. What is this for? No. Oh, just for the hell of it? Nice camera, by the way. <laughs> for cable. I mean, it, oh, is it for cable? All right, well, I thought the Pantera show was really good. I was in the mosh pit. I got in there. I had my game face on. I did what I had to do. And uh, eventually, it turned out that uh, I'm still not, you know, backstage. Of course, here we have Alan Tuggle, the, the rock and roll man here. Uh, what are the plans for the future, Alan? More fucking rock and roll, more helping of the goddamn local fucking music scene. One way or another. That's, That's right. what's important to me is the goddamn local music scene. I don't give a fuck about Z-Rock being gone. The local music scene is still here, still alive and kicking, and I'm gonna be here to back it any goddamn way I can. Hey, heavy metal is like, it's like cockroaches. You know, you stomp on it and it keeps coming back. Motherfuckers just won't die. That's all there is to it. This is Steve Curtis. Do we care? No. Here we have Steve Curtis, the Dark Alliance, doing it after all these years. How many catacides has it been? Um, 35. That's all. What? 35 dead cats to this date. But we don't kill them no more. We just like stick like firecrackers up their butt. Well, that's, that's a lot of mangled pussy. Come on down here. Sit on Santa's lap, tell him what you want. So, what's the plans for the future, Stevie? Well, we got Metal Blade, 
Island, Cage, and Pavement going, well, we want to sign you guys. So until they give us a good deal, we ain't signing shit. So, so what's the matter? You don't have a big pen on you to fill out the paperwork or what? Do it. No, you don't do that, man. That's stupid. You fucking, we got an entertainment lawyer who handles all that bullshit. We pay him to look over the contract, make sure everything's the way we want it. And then if it's cool, we send it back to him and then we go back and forth a couple times and that's the way it works. It's not like you go, oh, we're signed and you know, that's the way it is. It don't work that way. It don't work that way. Because if, you, you, if you sign, if you sign your life away for three years, what have you got? Nothing. You got your, your record on the shelf, and that's it. Not, and, and look, they're going to have Nirvana and Metallica on the shelf. What are they going to pick? Nirvana and Metallica, right? Okay. But if you have the right fucking promotion, then you'll fucking do okay. Well, I guess good things come to those who wait. But you've been waiting a long time, Steve. I want to see some shit happen with you. Not as long as Pantera waited. You're, you're getting old. Pantera waited 10 years. We've only waited six. That's true. And, and you're still getting messed up as ever. Right? No, I don't even drink. I don't, I don't drink or smoke or anything. <laughs> and I don't kill cats and fuck them up the ass either. Yes, he, yes, he does. He does things to animals that, well, nothing different than I do, but it's different because it's him. I'm Robert Mosley, and this is Underground Connection. What's up with this guy over here? What up? We're over here talking to Benny with a dead eye over here. Yeah, what's up, what's up, what's up? What do you think's going on here? I ain't never seen this guy sober yet. You'll never see me sober. That's one of the things that I've been trying to nationalize around the country. I've been contributing to the PACs, the PACs and shit for the government. I've been talking to Clinton severely about alcoholic recognition. Alcohol recognition should happen here today, which it should happen always. And that's what is up. I, you know, I still haven't got, I still haven't gotten my credit card in the mail yet. Yeah, well, you know, what happened was uh, we had a bunch of uh, people that <coughs> there were post toasty inspectors. They wanted to inspect my balls, so they came out and they inspected my balls. I couldn't help it. I just trying to make an honest buck. And they can all suck dick, period. Yeah, yeah. How about this lovely lady over here? Who is this? I don't know. Some girl. Who are you? Who am I? I'm Misty. That's Jeez, Misty, Misty over there. I am Scorpio. <laughs> Astrology woman. She don't. She don't believe I, the fact that. Uh, I only see one problem. That you know she's still wearing a shirt. Yeah, I know. I know, but you know she's a nice girl. Yeah, whatever. You know. <laughs> anyway, all I gotta say is that uh, the is gonna be on, uh, on on the shit like within two weeks. Now, the 11th, whatever, you know, but I'm talking about the Big Daddy shit's coming down. And all that shit here, you can raid my office, you can raid me, and if you like to raid me, you can smoke my pole. Period. And that's what happens when you drink too much. This is Robert Mosley, and the lights are going out. This is Robert Mosley with Underground Connection. Fuck you. Here, get some of that, Buck. Hey, Buck! Hey, Buck. Are you done? That's enough. Yeah, come down here, I'll give you a few spankings. Don't go away. Don't go away.
Let me see. Let me see. This song. This is my mic. I know it's a special mic. I need to back up, man. Right? Check out. You need to zoom back, dumbass. This right here, this right here is Holly. Say hello, Holly. Hi. She's a babe. We're gonna go out. How's it going? Everything's cold. We're getting the confetti. I have my happy thought. I have my happy thought. Yeah, they're trying to get they're trying to get you to flash the camera. Flash? No okay. way. I don't have I don't have <laughs> enough right. to flash. She ain't gonna do nothing like that. <laughs> no, nah, she don't. She don't wanna. You got your brown eye, brown eye winking. Yeah. Is this your friend over there? Who? Oh, that guy? Oh, you don't know this guy? No, oh, okay. no way. <laughs> this is my friend over here, Kathleen. I got Missy. two guys, two jobs. Oh, this is Kathleen and Missy. Hey, this is Kathleen and Missy. I got a pretty bra, but I don't got no tits. Yeah, like Missy. Look at it, 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 look at it. Hey, you take what you can. You take what you can. Yeah, show us your belly button, because we, we, we love belly buttons. Let's see some belly button action. Oh, wow, she's got hair on it, too. she got hair on it. Back. Back on underground connection. Fucking finally. We, Can we not say that? Is this going to be cable or what? Yeah, we'll beep it. Yeah, they do that, then. We'll fucking beep it. Yeah, because... Dude, Rob's all there. You're there the whole time, dude. Inside, asking and asking, and then I got stuck, got drunk, got upstairs. This but, guy goes way back. He's like a booger on the wall somebody smeared that will not go away. This is my sister. We were separated at birth. We're both sis sisters but, with each other but, like that. But we both got changes. And yeah, luckily we were able to hawk some stuff, afford those changes, and look at us now. Yeah, well, I still got the helmet at home as a reminder. We're going to have to... <laughs> What, what is that? What? Yeah, we're gonna have to find some uh, like some of the old just clippy shit. We'll definitely have to find some of the old clippings and do. D as uh, what what was the name? We used to run the lights. You always drank that electric iced tea. Oh my good God! What was that guy's name? It was the blonde hair. I see him all the he time. He wore the camel toes. The what are those? Yeah, he, he'd call you just clippy. That was it. Was just clippy. God, I don't even remember that dude's name at all. I know the guy, I mean, but he yeah, was always him. drunk, man. Yeah, exactly. And he was drunk as hell. He'd still run the lights, man. Yeah. It was funny as hell. He and then he'd, there, eventually, he he'd eventually pass out, and then, like, I'd run the lights for a little while. And, Dude, that's and then, the whole point. We were all there when we needed each other. Yeah, that's right, man. So, it was like, hey, I, I had your back, you know? Yeah, we got yours always and forever. Except that one night. <laughs> oh, I remember that. That's what happens, man. I was scared of death. that. That punk ass always going to break my <laughs> camera. I was like... 15, hey, 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 16. Hey, 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 get away from the camera. You're like, get away, man. You know, one night, this one skinhead dude was going to kick my ass, and he quite well could have because I used to watch him kick some people's ass. He used to yeah. run around with Christopher Broski, the guy, like, in jail for shooting people. And we yeah. had done some about yeah. him, but we were... I was afraid of him, okay? He happened to be busy, unfortunately. It's kind of hard to get He'd shit on He had kicked my you. ass all got, over the you place. You got shit strapped on you, and you're out fighting. Yeah. No, <laughs> But still, man. Let's not talk about that. But. Yeah, we'll just pass on that. But we got so much good times. There ain't enough, oh, yeah? there ain't enough bad times that can bring us down. There's right? too many bad times. They <laughs> always bring us down and make us that, we just ignore them like that. That's but right. We need man. Hello, welcome exactly. to George Garage. We always need to go to Eagles. This God, week, we I got have, the best goddamn PA in the state of Texas. Yeah, now, this week, now it's the second smallest car lot in the state of Texas. Yeah, yeah. Wake, this, wake up, Ab. Come on. Th this week, Let's do this shit again and do it right again. That's right. That's all we need it. This week we have the great the Pantera, and opening up for them as usual is Disciple. Exactly, man. Oh, man. That's just all. Was that the recording every week or what? I mean, well, those <laughs> that's were the what day. happens. Those were the days. Exactly, and it's obvious Pantera kept that place open, man. Right. Because uh, yeah. as soon as they left, left town, <laughs> the, it's a car lot, man. Okay. Literally, yeah. I mean, you talk about car lot. It's exactly. really a car lot. It really man. is, literally, man. Of course, that's like but, Ab's son, who's like. Pretty boy off into the money thing. Yeah. You know, and Ab. And, you know, but that ain't good for him, man. Money's money. See, first time, you Joe's was the first out. bar I ever went to. And it wasn't until I went to some other bars that I figured out that the bartenders are supposed to be beautiful women. Yeah. Sorry, Ruth. Oh, man, that's what happens. <laughs> Ruth oh, was nice, I guess. Always what Ben happens. never liked me, but Ben never liked anybody that he let him know about it, you know. Yeah. 
That's yeah. what happens, dude. That Here's, is always what happens. If you can only say one thing to yourself, look yourself in the mirror and go, that's what happens. Whether it's bad, good, I mean anything. If something good happens, because man, that's what happens. If it's bad, that's what happens. And that was today's sermon by <laughs> Dr. Dan Lehman. No, actually by Dr. Big Robbie. You said I was big. <laughs> now? <laughs> I don't now have the right helmet here. anymore. Now I we're can right here, though. Helmet. We're yeah. both right here now. Actually, you're up here I'm now. stand up straight. I'm kind of I'm trying to make you feel equal to me. but I'm like, you know, but if before, I had my boots and helmet on, he'd be... Dude, uh, we got, the, before, you watch some of them old 1991 videos. Shuts it off, What's that? We have to say thanks a lot to the gacko Maddox, Sonny, and to Big Dale. And Candyman. Who, hey, way to go, Candy. Exactly. Because I see Candy was hey, out tonight with his you bell bottles. Why? What's that? Because the candy man can. If the candy it man can. It with love and makes the world taste good. good. That's exactly the, why. And, and I'm the panty man. Ooh. And the panty man I'll let you, can. I'll let you describe that. <laughs> and I mix that with something else and it tastes even better. <laughs> All right, man. I got to go catch my sis. Yeah, he's got to go. They're looking at me funny. I don't want them getting mugged by the bush. Where the hell are they? Yeah, they are. <laughs> well, I don't want to get mugged by the bush and down. There, there goes Dan. Hey, uh, and don't kick your own ass anymore. Damn night. Hey, the, girls! The only guy I know who mugs himself. Who you, man? All right. There he goes. Watch him go.